Hi, welcome to Live Gluten Free or Die. I'm Isauda. I just wanted to show up today and give you guys three quick tips about traveling gluten free. Tip number one, always travel with your own snacks. Whether you're, to, you're traveling domestically and especially internationally, stock up on snacks that you really like. Kind Bar, Luna Bars. Just so you are aware that you have something to eat when you're hangry. And I get hangry. So make sure that you're prepared. Have your snacks. You're your biggest advocate. Make sure that you're prepared with snacks that you enjoy just in case they don't have a snack for you. Tip number two. Contact your airline. Most international flights are really long flights and they do provide meals. If you contact your airline and talk to them, they might have an option for you. A lot of times I've traveled on Delta and American Airlines and they provided a gluten-free meal on the plane. And that's a huge bonus. Make sure you call as soon as you book your flight. Make sure you call a week before your flight leaves and then call again 24 hours just to make sure that that gluten-free meal is on your reservation. And then be prepared just in case that meal doesn't show up with tip number one and have your snacks and your gluten-free sandwiches ready just in case. Because most of the time when, I, when I've traveled internationally, 90% of the time I've had the gluten-free option on my flight, but there was 10% when I didn't have them. So just keep that in mind. Tip number three, investigate the countries that you're going to. Do a quick Google search. I'm gonna be in this city. Are there any gluten-free options there? France, Germany, Spain, Italy, all have gluten-free options these days. But when you go to places like Vietnam, Thailand, Cambodia, there are gluten-free options there too, but you just have to dig deep. Here's a bonus tip. Create a card that actually has a list in the language of the country that you're going to of all the things you can't eat. This is going to help you tremendously. Being able to show this card to your servers at a restaurant, to the chef at a restaurant, and have them look through it, then they can have a conversation with you about the ingredients that you can eat. And this experience is one of the best experiences I ever had traveling. You're being so open with a person from another country. And honestly, I believe everyone is really good at heart and they want you to talk about their, your experience in their restaurant. They want you to share how delicious their food was. And the only way that could happen is if you eat their meals and don't die. If you're liking what you're watching, please double click and subscribe. And if you're planning on taking an adventure, where would you go next? Stay safe out there and don't die. Bye.